What's up, Rory? How you guys doing? Today, we're going to talk about, you know, one of the questions I get asked frequently, you know, with a lot of uh, people that are starting their business, a lot of people that have family members in their business, and they're having a lot of issues, a lot of difficulties, and a lot of problems where, uh, you know, some want to do the work uh, more than others, some ain't doing the work, some ain't fucking uh, meeting up to their standards, or they fucking uh, go about the fucking... Uh, uh, the wrong uh, uh, approach uh, on how to conduct themselves when shit's going uh, uh, down or when shit's not uh, going accordingly to what we uh, what they spoke about. You know, at the beginning, a lot of people get hyped up, they get pumped up, and uh, a lot of shit is said. You know, and once the wheels are turning, once the fucking uh, business starts growing, you know, a lot of people fall off. You know, that's been happening. You know, a lot. I see that shit a lot. I like I was part of it. You know, I've been part of a lot of fucking, uh, you know, uh, businesses that I was, uh, you know, that I was in, you know, that I was, uh, you know, part of, you know, and I seen a lot of just uh, failure, you know, failure because a lot of people, you know, there, there, there's a lot of fucking uh, too many fucking chiefs, not enough fucking Indians, you know, and that's the fucking problem. You know, a lot of people want to be the, the one. But they forget that, you know, a lot of people, you know, in all reality, what did you really bring to the table? You know, what did you bring? Your appetite? So you got to understand that there's a lot of people just salting a lot of people and uh, wishing them bad because they got done wrong, because they didn't get the pay that they they were asking, you know, or it didn't, the plan didn't go accordingly or all of a sudden, you know, he's making more than me and, and what the fuck is that? And you got to fucking sit back. And fucking really fucking, uh, uh, you know, sit with yourself and realize that, you know what, a lot of times, you know, these people, especially family members, they think that they're entitled of uh, more just because they're your family member. And uh, like I said, that's why nobody fucking advances. That's why nobody grows because they're always trying to pull you back. If They're always counting your money. They're always fucking seeing what you're doing. They're always seeing you know, what you're buying, you know, a lot of times people fucking forget that, you know, you didn't fucking start, you know, all you did was, you know, you were off for a job, you were out for a position and all of a sudden, you know, you think that you're entitled of uh, much more, you know, and that's where everybody goes wrong. That's where a lot of fucking just business fall, uh, relationship with family members, they, if they fall, the friends, they, it falls because uh, everybody thinks that they should be somewhere and, and, and that they're not, you know, and that's the main that's the main problem with a lot of like, you know, uh, you know, society nowadays, you know, that they think that they're the ones they think that they deserve more. And you got to fucking actually work for it. You got to fucking become a fucking act, asset because uh, a lot of people are liabilities. All they are is liabilities. They're fucking causing trouble. They're fucking causing a fucking uh a problem from uh, people growing, from your business growing, because you're the fucking bad seed of the fucking uh, of the company, you know, because you always have a fucking attitude. You always have something to say. I've seen that shit, like I said, from time to time. And uh, it, it's just, it's sickening, you know, because that's why nobody ever fucking makes it. Nobody ever advanced, you know, to uh, the next level because you're always trying to put that other man down. You're always trying to fucking wish bad upon him. You're, you know... Like I said, he starts making the X amount of money. You start feeling that envy, that jealousy that goes around. It's just fucking a, a bunch of bullshit, man. And like I said, I've seen it from time to time again. So like that person that asked me about, you know, how to go about, you know, him, uh, you know, from uh, stopping his family to, you know, from falling apart. Because uh, like I said, they were all in it. You know, the mom was in it, the, the you know, like the brothers, you know, six brothers. And everybody wants to cry about when shit hits the fan. But when everything's going good, there's always that unhappy, uh, unhappy person because, like I said, you know, so, somebody's getting paid more than the other. And then everybody thinks they're entitled to the fucking same fucking pay. And it doesn't work like that, you know, just because they're your family, just because uh, you think that you deserve it because, uh, you know, they're, they're your blood. Nah, man, you got to fucking put in the work. And a lot of people here, they forget about that shit. They forget about when that shit was fucking barely getting built. You know, you were asked to come and fucking uh, and and help and get paid. Uh, you know, and uh, and you agree with it, but all of a sudden, you see that shit escalating and just you know, uh, like I said, that other person. It's always that jealousy, that envy that you see that other person that got you fucking the job, that got you there, that fucking helped you when you need it. Uh, 
that job, uh, now all of a sudden, you know, you're, you're hating on that person, you know? You're seeing them seeing, um, different. Like if he has to fucking uh, uh, pay you more, like if he has to fucking, uh, 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 fucking give you more than, than what you're doing just because he's blood or just because he's making X amount of money, like, nah, man, that has to come from them, you know? So when people go in with that attitude, with that mindset, you know, you're just gonna be bitter. You're just gonna be fucking a, a resentful person towards them. You're gonna start, you know, just being negative and just fucking spreading a bunch of negative rumors through to the other employees, to the other people around you, just to uh, make that person seem like a, a horrible person. And that shit is, is what's fucking bullshit, you know, nowadays, you know? And that's why I see more and more and time and time again that that's why companies fail when you wanna start your company, your little business with your family, thinking that they're gonna be the ones that are gonna help you more, thinking that they're the ones that are gonna be happy for you because you're starting something from scratch and then you're you know, trying to be better, trying to become better and uh, try to make something out of uh, nothing, you know? And uh, that's the fucking sad part. Like I said, you know, too many people are wishing bad upon others' uh, success, you know? A bunch of fucking hate, a bunch of fucking envy. And that's what you gotta fucking just fucking sit back and realize what you're fucking doing. There's a lot of other fucking people that that's not the way they work. That's why they scale higher because they help each other, because they push each other, because they're like, okay, you know, you start your business, I'll help you out. Bam, we're gonna fucking take it to the next level. Then you help that other person. You scratch my back, I scratch your back. And that's how it works. And that's why you see these people succeeding. You know, there's the other uh, races out there that, you know, they're closer, they're more, uh, they bond together. They have a plan. They they go in there with the, that vision of a, uh, nah, man, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna fucking take this to the next level, then we're gonna open another one, and you're gonna be in charge of that, and, and everybody's fucking happy because everybody eats, you know? There's not one more than the other, and uh, we're all the same. So that's why they fucking do that. But now when it comes to, you know, people that, uh, you know, wanna fucking hate on the other person or, or just fucking run out of fucking envy and jealousy, you know, all you're doing is just uh, bringing, bringing your people down, you know? Especially, like I said, in, in family, you know, it's, it's sometimes it just goes, uh, uh, you know, there's a tragic, you know, it, it, it just goes all bad, you know, all bad because, you know, people stop talking, you know, people start fucking resent, uh, resenting each other. They start fucking uh, uh, wishing bad upon each other. And it's just fucking, it's a bunch of fucking bullshit, you know, all because that fucking person made it happen all because that person, you know, succeeded and, and the plan went accordingly to, you know, how he visioned it. And, uh, but like I said, you, you know, you think that you're entitled of, uh, of more, if you're entitled of more, if you have that in your head, then you should be more, you should fucking put in the effort. Like I said, me, for example, every fucking job that I went, I fucking always gave it my all because I was going to make a point. I was going to prove a fucking point that, you know, if, so to me, like I said, if, if the fucking business go down or, or they had to fucking get rid of me for whatever circumstances, they wanted to save money, it was gonna fucking, it, it was hard. Make make yourself fucking hard for them not to fucking get rid of you is my fucking point. So become a fucking asset instead of a liability. You know, for me, like I said, I'm fucking just, like I said, every job that I stepped into, you know, I gave it my all and I made sure that, you know, they weren't gonna get it. I was the last person to fucking go. That's for damn sure. If they were to pick a person, it's always going to be that lazy motherfucker. It's always going to be that complain, co complainer, that whiner, that fucking hater, that fucking guy that's bitter with low energy, with fucking just a uh, uh, negative attitude. Those are the fucking first ones to fucking, uh, you know, get disposed of, you know? So don't be that one. If you think you deserve more, then fucking put in the work so you could get paid more, you know? But all those people that are wish or that they want more, or they want to shit on the other people that's doing more than them, those motherfuckers are the ones that do the least, you know? So recognize that shit, you know? So for you people out there that want to fucking uh, succeed or think that you deserve more, you better start putting in the work more and do extra, you know? So they could see that shit, so they could value that shit. And you know what? Sometimes, you know, those people ain't gonna see it, you know? That's when you recognize and you fucking just keep on pushing and move on because somebody is watching you and somebody is gonna fucking take you into consideration and actually, um, you know, give you what you're worth, you know? But like I said, don't let that shit get you down. Don't let that shit be, you know, become a fucking uh, 
a, 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 a fucking uh, poison in you where you start thinking negative and just start doing less instead of doing more. Get in control. And like I said, that's when businesses succeed is because you put the fucking hard work and dedication and you become a fucking asset instead of a liability. Let's fucking run it.